Today we are going to focus on how to multiply three or more single digit numbers. So that's our learning intention. We are learning to multiply three or more single digit numbers. These means numbers with only one digit. I'm successful when I can group multiplication facts. I can show my working out and I can work backwards to check my answer. So I have a multiplication fact here and it's 2 times 3 times 5. When I mean group multiplication facts, I'm going to solve 2 times 3 first. So we know that 2 times 3 equals 6. I'm now going to take the 6 and times that by 5. I know that 6 times 5 is 30. So my answer is 6 to 2 times 3 times 5 equals 30. I just screwed my multiplication facts. I showed my working out. Now I need to work backwards to check my answer. I take 30 and if I divide that by 5, it equals 6. I then take 6 and divide that by 3 and that equals 2. If I take these numbers, I can go 5 times 3 times 2 equals 30. Same numbers, just different order and they get the same answer. Here's another problem. I'm going to say 8 times 4 times 3. In terms of grouping, I might choose to work out 8 times 4 first. I might choose to work out 4 times 3 first. I might choose to work out 8 times 3. But I'm going to start off with my larger numbers first today. So I'm going to say 8 times 4. I know that 8 times 4 is 32. I'm now going to take 32 and times that by 3. I know that if I split 32, I'm going to show working out here, I'm going to go 30 times 3, and I'm going to go 2 times 3. I know that 30 times 3 is 90, and I know that 2 times 3 is 6, which means that is 96. My answer is 96. Now let me check my answer. 96 divided by 3 is 32. 32 divided by 8 equals 4. So I can go back to 3 times 8 times 4. I can work backwards to check my answer. I hope you enjoyed this video on learning how to multiply 3 or 4, 3 or more single digit numbers. Please subscribe to Diggy Oz Teacher on YouTube and social media for more videos.